it's only the second game in the group phase, but already this is crunch time for some, certainly those who have suffered defeat in their opening game. The prospect of an early exit already hangs above their heads. The players and managers have to put a brave face on it in the pre-match press conference, but that is not going to change the overwhelming truth here, and that is that they really must seek to avoid defeat. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Hungary faced here with what can already be a make-or-break game. Well, it doesn't have to be doom and gloom simply because you've lost. Shalai has a go. Sneers it out of harm's way. Lingered over it, and the chance to counter had gone. Shalai cannot be that slow. And it took the sting out of the break, and uh, a big chance wasted. Matridi gets it back. And here's Shalai. He's had that put on a... And the shot! Goal! Hungary! Loris reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Hungary take the early advantage. Lamar. Koeman. And he's whipped it in low. Dashing forward at pace. Lamar battles to win it back. And the counter is on. He's found his man. And here's Griezmann, foot in. Oh, defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Defenders on the back foot. He's played him through. He's got it, and he's got time. France have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Pavard has got himself a free kick. And he's going to have his name taken. France ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. Mondi tries to get it forward quickly. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Shall I? Oh, he's been flattened there. Havar. Hungary find themselves a goal up here. It's a lead to cherish. Matridi spreads it towards the left. Koeman. Lamar. He's got the ball, he's got the space. Massive leap! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Griezmann really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was.
Griezmann with the short one. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And it's Griezmann. Just brushed off the ball there. Hungary have it back and they can go again. Umba Umbappe! Good first touch and almost as good a second. Mbappe brilliantly took control of that, which was exactly what the situation required. Great strength, going for goal! He's looking to get... Oh, real danger here! Tolisso goes looking, and he's looking at the referee, and the referee is shaking his head. Mondi. Longley plays it forward. That intervention was very necessary. Deflected over the goal line for a corner. Griezmann plays it short. Played in deep. And he's there to cut it out. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Kimpembe does well to read it and intercepts. Matuidi. Coman. Coman. Coman gets it out to the wing. Breaks on here. And it's the whistle for half time. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. The Magic still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom at the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Hungary are in at half-time with a slender one-goal lead. Already up and running for the second half. Hungary carrying a one-goal lead. Oh, needed a better pass there. Lobs it in gently. Out for a goal kick. Ball through needs to be good here. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Kante drives it forward. Kimpembe. 
Pavar. Coma. And here's Griezmann. And it's Conte. Conte is fouled. Mendy gets it into the middle. Oh, they could break here. Shall I? Juczak is now the subject of some adhesive marking. Well, they would... Has a hit! And he heaves it forward. Conte, Pavar, so Jim, what are you thinking? I think the manager's pondering his options as to whether to stick or twist Peter in view of, of the time remaining. He might have a, a tough call to make now. But Tweedy plays it over to the other flank. It's gone up for a throw in. France are making a change now. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Oh, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Get the better of his opposite number. Koeman. Played out to the right. Pavar looking to get on the end of this. Hernandez. Longley. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1-0. Forward it goes. Cut out in the nick of time. Mbappe has a shot! Oh, that is rather wayward.
hoists it forward. Kimpembe. And it's played forward. Coman. Jack there's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed but will they well, he's made sure that that won't get through this is good ball retention and it should be enough from here, but they want to double there. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. <laughs> Mbappe. France are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. It's got through to him. Well positioned to make that interception. Hungary are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. And here's the chance to counter. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Now it's Griezmann. He's left his man. A famous win all but confirmed. They just need to hold on for a few more minutes. And here's Chujak. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Lamar. Looking to break out here. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Hungary, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. Well, they've done what they needed to here. They have bounced back from defeat on day. If, and it is a fairly big if, they can take all three points here to add to the solitary point they already have in the bag. There are, of course, so many permutations, combinations, that the various potential outcomes of this game could lead to, but there is never any space for debate as to what the team should be going for. They know what they've got to do. This one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Germany looking at a pivot. Goes for goal! And there's an early warning shot across the bow. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Bruno Fernandes. Jean Moutinho, Bruno Fernandes. Portugal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Lobs it in gently. Bernardo Silva really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn.
And here's Canapri. Bruno Fernandes. João Cancelo plays it forward. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Ruben Neves. And the shot! Goretzka. Ricardo Pereira. Ruben Diaz. And out to safety. And here's Canabri. Canabri really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. And here's Canabri. Gundawan. And that has been clubbed away. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Kimmich. Canabri. Gone for a throw in. Jao Cancelo with the crossfield ball. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He gets past his man. Ruben Diaz. Oh, some tackle that. Germany. Good no one! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Xiao Moutinho. Bruno Fernandes. Xiao Moutinho. It's got through, a big chance! Think that's offside. Yes, it is. Ruben Neves, still rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. It's a promising ball, he's got away, crosses it in, cut out in the nick of time. Tony Kroos. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Now, hits one! Quick ball forward. Bernardo Silva. He's got options out wide. Once ball, who's going to get there? Well, that is asking for trouble. In once more. It's a brilliant interception. It's Kroos! The defence can get it clear. A really close shave, and the last action of the first half. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. <laughs> Germany head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Quite capable. Start of another 45 minutes. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully, they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more. The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, 
It was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. Conceding free kicks in areas like that are an invitation to the set-piece technicians. They have to cut this out. Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! That has certainly tested the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Bruno Fernandes, who's short. Bernardo Silva delivers. Well read, he sorted that out. Tries to get it forward quickly. Kimmich. Good ball. And he's straight offside. Kimmich. It's got through to him. He's off on a marauding run. Gnabry! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Well, he could end up like a lost sheep, Peter, because they're trying to shepherd him everywhere he doesn't want to go. Oh, sweet feet. Over to the left. That's a case of crossing and hope, and unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. Thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Germany put themselves into the lead. Well, we certainly had to wait for it, Peter. Now a difficult decision. Is it stick or twist? And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Jota, Jean Moutinho, Kroos gets it back, Kroos puts his foot on the gas, now the counter, Kroos, it's Kroos! Oh, that is rather wayward, another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Portugal showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Kroos battles to win it back. Kroos. Determined run, but equally determined piece of defending. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. And he's tried to lob him! A finish right from the top draw. They have come roaring back. Smartly deceptive. What quality. Oh, Peter, it's a lovely piece of deception in shaping to whack it and then opting for a lovely little lob. So we have a double substitution going on here. That has certainly made things interesting. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goals. They just got caught napping. And he's cut it out. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner.
Ruben Diaz. Ruben Diaz drives it forward. Gets away from his opponent. Jota. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Portugal showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Gundogan has it in a wide position, so what next? Incoming cross. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Decent looking ball. And he's there to cut it out. Germany merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Ronaldo, who's made his mark on this game. Just five minutes left. Well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain. They're not going to get back into the game like this. And it's Mario Rui. Good challenge, he just stood firm. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. One final crack at it now. Jota. Jota spreads it towards the left. Looks to drop one in. Goalkeeper's ball. Gnabry. Just brushed off the ball there. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that's that. So it's ended in a draw. Craft and graft and everything apart from a winning goal that never came. An intriguing contest. And a result which at least partly satisfies all.